no one else dares face me. Is there truly no warrior in all Skellige who can defeat me? I've not seen you here before. What do they call you? Geralt of Rivia. I'm Yuta Undemon. No man's been found who could best me in combat. Will you fight me? You? I've defeated Pharaoh's most famous warriors. Men so worthy of respect, I don't dare mention their names. And who is Geralt of Rivia? Someone you haven't defeated. Maybe you're not worthy of my time? You performed any great feats? Because I don't believe I've heard. What kind of feats you have in mind? Hmm. I'll fight you, if you defeat Gundar. Couldn't best me, but he's a brave man and a worthy opponent. Good. I'll give it a shot. See you soon. I truly wonder if you will. Farewell. You've come a long way. Ah! You here? To but can you toss an axe? Can you throw the can? Respect, Witcher. you why me exactly asking out of curiosity given you're a foreigner all right you just said she'd fight me if I defeated you you just said that means that if I win she'll give me another chance well come on let's do this you step outside the ring you lose got it Enough. Good luck with Utah. So what is she to you? The sorceress, Yennefer, right? Greetings, White One. I defeated Gundar. Hmm. Thought you'd be no match for him. All right. We'll see how you fare against me. Ready when you are. Then let's start. May Freya choose the victor. Not surprised you have a hard time finding worthy opponents. In the end, one came along. Where'd you learn all that? At Kaer Morhen. Kaer Morhen? That's terribly far. But you learned a great deal on the road as well, surely. Would you tell me about it? It'd make for a long story. All right. We need a quiet spot, some good mead, and... What do you say? Gladly. See you at the inn? Too rowdy. Come to my home in Harvican. I'll be waiting after dusk. See you later then. You've come a long way. Greetings. I started to think you changed your mind. I'd never miss a chance to spend a pleasant evening with you. I don't know that I'll make for engaging company. In truth, I rarely talk to men. Rarely? Why? Well, I don't like to waste time chatting before fights. And after them, I've none left to talk to. And now that I've finally met someone stronger... Seems Freya's played a cruel trick on me. What's Freya got to do with it? 
I swore to the goddess that only he who bested me in battle would lie with me, take me as his wife, and give me children. Can't really help you with the second and the third. But I'm sure I could think of something to satisfy the first. Exactly what I'd hoped for. Feeling any better? What's the matter? Maybe told on me brothers. Mikhail and Ulf sailed to Hindusfjall to fetch Agda. Weddings in but a few days. But they've yet to return. A storm broke while they were gone. I fear it might have blown them onto the rocks at Pharaoh. Many have lost their lives there. I'll sail out to find them. I would, but I've got to make sure the wedding's proper prepared. They say it's not fitting for a Skelliger to ask for aid, but I've no choice. Will you help me? Will you seek out my kin? Fine. I'll look around for them. Sirens, though. Must have nabbed her body soon after she drowned. Kira's lamp ought to prove really handy here. Forgive your sons. Meant to escort our brother's patrol to her wedding, a storm beset us and bested us. All is lost. Magda lies dead. Her dowry drowned. Tis a taint on the clan's honor. Forgive us, O oh Freya, most noble. Stop, Miguel. Freya can't wash our shame away. Only blood can. Let's do it as it must be done. There. Beneath the tree. We'll pray, and then end it. I, you're right. Be better that way.
Skellig in honor. Chose to die instead of living with the knowledge they'd let down their brother. some bad news. Sadly, Agda's dead. So are your brothers. Uh, what? Huh? What are you saying? A storm destroyed their boat. Agda was killed. Your brothers felt they'd let you down. Couldn't live with the shame. They chose death. Found this letter. Might help you come to terms. A letter? That's all that's left of them. Sorry, didn't find anything else. And it hurts horrible. As if as if something was tearing me apart from inside. You should go see the um talker. Already. They said their herbs can't help. And all that's left is to pray. So have you? I prayed when Yar left me. When my mother fell ill. When the sheep were dying. I had no prayers left in me. Uncle said folk on the continent got heads like cats. Like it here. Only got cats eyes. You're a witcher, right? Can't seal out the fish with the black ones around, so gotta just catch me. Hey there. Heard you calling. Aye, because I was. I thank Mother Nature she didn't skimp on my voice as she did with some others I know. See, one of us, a gill, went mute all of a sudden. No spell or potion helps him. But it is said strong emotions and experiences can restore speech. So I thought perhaps you might. I'll pay you, of course. It give you an excellent Gwent card. Suppose I could try, but I wouldn't even know where to start. You want me to scare him? Aye, good, good. That should do it. Scare, irritate, whatever you wish, provided you do him no harm. You can usually find a gill near the hallowed oak. Poor man, he's probably praying in his heart for a cure. Silent druid? Oh, yeah. Dumb question. They ever try to cure you some other way? Give you potions or herbs? Huh. Not just mute. Seems he's deaf, too. When do you lose your voice? Can you show me? Hold up some fingers? Uh, charming man. Hmm. Doesn't look like we'll figure much out talking. So long. Talking won't get me anywhere.
Maybe he'll say something if I put out his fire. Tin pots. Stand to make a lot of noise. Maybe give him a smack once he's asleep. Well, really. Well, it certainly didn't turn out well. Out of my sights, Rain! I <laughs> heard him screaming clear over here. Grand work, Witcher. Your reward, as promised. Don't like being played for a fool. Remember that, or next time you'll be the one left speechless. Challengers. Welcome to our tournament, Witcher. Einar awaits an opponent. Do you wish to face him? Let's not keep Einar waiting. May it be a clean and beautiful fight. Beautiful fight. Congratulations on your victory. Grim will be glad to mix it up. If you've any fight left in you, that is. What's that supposed to mean? This here's a calm village. Ooh! Maybe he's huh. looking to get hired on a ship. heard of you. Don't recall exactly why, but I'm sure it was unsavory. Heard you, uh, hold fights here. Ye heard right. Try your luck if you like. I'm ready. Fight mercilessly, but do it with honor. And save some strength for your next bout. <laughs> Get out 
the traveler wins it! Free it, damn it. You fought well. You've earned the right to face Olaf of Anskellig. Good luck to you. In the eyes. Must be the one the Jarl summoned. This here's a calm village. I read you leave, not the Elmer did all the work. You've come to fight Olaf. He's long awaited a worthy opponent. I want to face Olaf. This fighting's a Skellig a tradition. And here on Anskellig, that tradition's damn near hallowed. I'll fight as though my life depended on it. What do they call ye? Geralt of Rivia. Geralt of Rivia. Enter the arena. Emerge victorious, and you'll have the honor to face the champion of champions. Damn, these commas strutting them. We gotta drag their corpses out of the inn. Fighting is our sacred tradition. The blood spilt in this arena bears witness to the clan's strength. The victor today will be champion. Yet any who is bold enough to fight is already a hero. Defeated Ola. It was a fair fight. Anyone else out there I could fight? You defeated everyone there was to defeat in Skellige. Makes you champion of the Isles. Take pride, friend. <laughs> 